My name is Russ Spencer, and I wanted to go into the Navy with a good friend of mine in March of 44. We had a big send-off at the Wayne Station, the band and the people and whatnot, and it was rather embarrassing for me because I was home that night. I was only 17, and they would not take me at that time. I graduated from Radnor High School in the middle of June, and in July 6th, I went into the Navy. Went to Bainbridge, Maryland for boot camp and also to quartermaster school. After I got out of quartermaster school, I was assigned to a destroyer escort in Casco Bay, Maine. Got on at 6 o'clock at night and we were going to do convoy duty to Liverpool, England. They gave me a wheel watch at midnight and I'd never had a wheel in my hand going across. I wasn't the best helmsman. The captain said, who's on the wheel? <laughs> and he didn't know me. I just got on the plane, on the ship about six hours ago. Things worked out quite well. We uh, were in the North Atlantic. We got credit for one submarine. We were in the Mediterranean for a while, and then our last port of call was Londonderry, Ireland. The war was over in 45 in Europe, and they took our ship to Brownsville, Texas to convert it into a radar picket ship to go into the Pacific. The captain of our ship recommended I go to officer candidate school, and I didn't know whether he thought I was a good man or wanted to get me <laughs> off the wheel. Went to Farragut, Idaho, took courses in math and science, and then took a troop train from Seattle in the state of Washington to Oxford, Mississippi, and had my freshman year at Ole Miss. Was discharged from the service in Memphis, Tennessee, and I'd like to make a comment that my good friend Don Clark, a retired attorney for Bell Telephone, was also is a member of this Wayne Presbyterian Church and a valued member of our Navy unit in Ole Miss. I was very fortunate to have the experience I had, and when I graduated from Princeton four years later, I got a commission along with my degree. Mm -hmm. Serving in the Navy was a real fine experience for me relationships you had with the men and the officers and the people you dealt with to helped you to be able to see the importance, important things in life and to act upon them. I enjoyed my experience and I felt I was a very fortunate individual to have had that.